Today in Helping Others, McKaylee is going to be interviewing Sam, which is a motivational speaker. Hi guys, today I'm, your, I'm McKaylee and I'll be your host for Helping Others. Today I'm interviewing Sam because he's a motivational speaker and I would love to be a motivational speaker. Um, Sam, is, do you mind if I ask you any questions? Go ahead. How did you get started on becoming a motivational speaker? Okay. Well, throughout the podcast, um, we decided that with our other means of do other services, because podcasts don't cost really to make money. So motivational speaking really costs money to like get booked in a way. So, and honestly, that's when it really started. Um, are you nervous when you talk to groups of people? Uh, no. Advice for that, if you are nervous, is you really, when you're doing it, it's going to sound awful, but it's not really me. When, when you're doing the speech itself, um, you really don't care what the audience thinks in the moment. I mean, you can care afterwards and beforehand, but I guess advice for you is really not caring about when, why, when you're doing a speech. It's just you presenting in the speech, so in retrospect, no, for that reason. Thank you. How do people find out about you? Uh, sometimes I wonder the same thing, but usually throughout the pod- podcast or the website autismrocksandrolls.com. Okay. Sounds neat. How many kids do you think you've reached? Oh. Um, well, that's a good question. Um, I would say several. I don't. I don't know. Quite frankly, I would say maybe more adults than kids, but I would say some kids. Okay. Um, what is your hobby, or what do you do in your free time? Uh, free time, it's a variety of things. Pretty much a hangout type of guy, or hang around in like a billiards area. Definitely a big pool guy, or swimming around, you know, that stuff. Okay, thank you. As a child in elementary school, who do you think was your ace? An ace here at Lena Don is a adult who like supports you and you can talk to whenever. All right. Well, as far as ace, um, I would have to say no one. But ace, as far as childhood, really more of what I thought. Of, I looked that I thought of that. Um, it's more of a thing than a. Um, person so it's really professional wrestling i love that since i was six and that's really helped me through some tough times in child so i guess the ace really was watching pro wrestling and i guess having conversations with myself and probably playing characters that i wanted to play but didn't have the courage to yeah um what is your peak of the week a peak is like something really good uh well the week starts so it's kind of hard to tell um <laughs> Um, probably, or probably now, let's be honest. Um, what was your valley? A bad thing that has happened? Or something hard. Or something hard this week? Well, the week started, so that's also <laughs> hard to tell. Um, so, the week, the, I guess the, so all that hasn't gotten ready yet for the day. Well, sort of, I mean, a, a reference and stuff, but I guess that's the valley. Yeah. Um, do you have any questions for me? I do not. Thank you for, thank you though. You did well. Okay. Makes you feel any better. <laughs> Bye guys. I learned so much today. Thank you for watching. Have a great day.